confident that you've got me here. Pure insurance! I'm the captain of this ship because I look at every possibility. Check to make sure my ass is covered in each situation. I think about what's gonna happen if this guy screws me, if this one turns states, and so on. That's why you're the boss, boss. Shut up! Jesus, you're worse than my mother. Anyways, that's why Ray ain't ever gonna make it to the level he wants to reach. He's too busy thinking about himself. That diamond fuck up his case in point. I'm like a fucking chess player. You're covering me for six moves ahead when me and the Favanos is just putting our first pawns out there on a checkerboard. Ah, I like what you did there, Skip. Real clever. Can you do me a favor? Can you just shoot yourself to save me the trouble of doing it? Can you, Marco? Jesus! Motherfucker! Give him the...
Here you go. You're a good earner, Nico. Take me back to my place. In 100 yards, turn left. I can't believe that Pavanos would treat me like this. The Pegarino name should mean something to them. It means something in Alderney. Even if it don't, then Algonquin. They better not think of crossing that West River and not looking over their shoulders. Too bad about Marco and Pete. Marco and Pete? Oh, yeah. Those guys didn't make it, did they? Well, too fucking bad. They knew what they were signed on for. Weren't complaining on the way out, were they? No, they weren't. Happy to be on board with the skipper. Yeah, well, they seemed like good kids. Ah, these kids come and go. It ain't worth paying attention to them until they prove they can survive. I just move on and hire some wannabe wise guys off the street. It's that simple? Has to be. I only start paying attention to my crew when they start putting me in an awkward position, either because they know too much my rat, or because they got too much power and they're too smart to get themselves clipped. Ray was nothing to me until he started earning big and sticking his nose in places that didn't belong. Rats seem to get everywhere you don't want them to be. The only way you know is by finding their shit all over the place in the morning. Phil's different. He's been my man for a while. I mean, how much can I do with a guy who ain't a full Italian? He's 90% Irish. It don't do too well for the reputation of us Pegarinos having St. Patrick that high up in our organization. You see the respect we're getting out on the street? Jesus!
out of the way. 